Hi guys, welcome to Joshua's Tech Tips. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you could reset the admin password on a FortiGate device. So this method is particularly useful if you forgot your admin password. Similarly to what I did um, with this device, I forgot the admin password and I can't enter it. So I'm going to show you how to reset your admin password. So if that's something you're interested in seeing, stay tuned. So before we actually get started with the password reset, there are three things in particular that we need to have. One, we need to have physical access to the FortiGate device. Unfortunately, we can't do this over um, Telnet or SSH. You need to be physically located next to the FortiGate device. Two, you're going to need a console cable since we'll be connecting to the FortiGate's console port. And three, we need a terminal emulation program such as Putty. Um, Putty is free to download and that's what I'll be using in this video. So once we meet the requirements, let's get started with the actual password reset. So first thing I want to do is I want to open Putty or whatever emulation program you're using. And I'm going to... Uh, connect to the necessary comms port. In my case, it's com3. Um, once I do so, um, it should prompt me to log in to the FortiGate device. Um, so what we need to do here now is actually unplug the FortiGate device and plug it back on. All right, so basically it's just a hard reboot um, in other words, and this is necessary in order for the password reset to um, work. Right, so I just unplugged it and I plugged it back in and I'm waiting for the FortiGate device to load up. Alright, so let's just give it a few seconds to be fully initialized. So now that the FortiGate is initialized, it's going to prompt you to log in. So we want to use the maintainer username as our login um, username. So you simply type in the word maintainer. So let me do that now. And press enter. And now it's going to ask you for your password. So for the password, what we're actually going to do is we're going to enter the letters B, C, P, B, and then we're going to enter our serial for the device. All right? So just as you see it there, it's B, C, P, B, and then this device serial. The device serial can be found under the device in most cases. Once you do that, you just enter that there and it should say welcome. I just copied and pasted it to make it simpler. Next, once it tells you welcome, you're going to set the password, the new password that is for the device. So it's simply set password and whatever you want the password to be. Um, in my case, it's 1 to 8. All right, unknown action. Oh, my bad. So I actually forgot to do something here. Right, so we need to actually enter the configuration mode before we could edit the admin password. So to enter the configuration mode, we're going to type config system admin. And this would more or less bring us to configuration mode. Press enter. Now we're in configuration mode, so we want to enter the commands to edit the admin password. So we need to type edit admin. Press enter. Now we enter the new password that we want to set. So it's set password and whatever you want the password to be. So in my case, I'm going to enter 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. You enter whatever you want. And once we have finished setting our password, we simply type end to end our session. Now heading back over to the web interface, I'm going to try logging in with the new password 1234567 and if all went well, I should be able to log into my FortiGate device. And yes, success. So this shows that I am logged into the FortiGate device and it brings up the wizard and stuff like that. So guys, as always, um, thanks for joining me in this video. If you like the content I'm creating, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the notification bell to be notified once a new video is released. Thanks again for viewing. See you soon.